Good morning, YouTube friends. It's Kevin here. Uh, it's Friday, and it's quite cool this morning, actually. Um, but I wanted to make a video response to uh, Bald Pipe Smoker and his 328 subscriber contest, if I have that correct. Um, first off, congratulations uh, on the 328 plus now. I noticed you have uh, about 340, um, which is really awesome. Uh, I hope someday to get to that point, um, but you deserve that. Uh, I really enjoy your videos, particularly your tobacco reviews. And uh, I just thank you for making all the videos and uh, for being a part of the community. And thank you for having this contest. <clears throat> so, um, you're asking us, we'll tell you a little bit more about ourselves, uh, which I think is a great, great idea. Uh, I love getting to know you guys more and ladies. And uh, myself. Well, I live in West Virginia, um, married, going on nine years, got two young boys with another one on the way, and uh, I'm originally from New York, uh, New York City actually, and I grew up most of my life, I'd say, yeah, in New York. Uh, Went, moved to Colorado, um, where I met my wife, and we moved back to the East Coast, and here we are, we settled down here. <clears throat> I am a, uh, picked up cigarette smoking at uh, about the age of 14, and uh, smoked for about 12 years before I quit, and right around the time I was quitting cigarettes friend of mine, I don't know, on a whim, I think, um, he and I went to a deli in New York, you know, they have delis everywhere, and so we went to a deli, and they had a little, a humidor, believe it or not, bagel shop slash deli, and they had a humidor with some, some premium cigars in there, so on a whim, he bought a handful of, I want to say, I want to say they were Macanudo cigars. Right, they could have been Arturo Fuentes, but I think they were Macanudos. So he picked up a handful, and he was a cigarette smoker too. So he, we're driving home, and he lights up the cigar. And I haven't, I hadn't at that point been around too many people who smoked cigars. Um, I had some relatives who smoked, but they all they smoked cheap, you know, drugstore cigars. And. Uh, the aroma wasn't all that pleasing, but when my buddy lit up that cigar, I was just, it was, it, the smell was intoxicating, so I asked him for one, and uh, <clears throat> we smoked it together, and the next day, I went right back to that same store, and I bought a couple of Arturo Fuentes that they had, uh, and they were Hemingway's, believe it or not, I clearly remember this, and thus began my journey cigar smoking and I was I pretty much at that point I was very partial to um, Arturo Fuente cigars and then um, I got into Monte Cristo's the Dominican Monte Cristo's and uh, you know my, I've tried different sticks over the years and my tastes have changed they vary so uh but pipe smoking, I got into, um, just, I, I had wanted to get into it. I thought about it over the time as a cigar smoker. Uh, and I just, it just looked like it would be too much, too much hassle to have to, to have a pipe. You gotta pack the bowl. You gotta do all kinds of crap. You gotta keep the pipe clean. You gotta do, you know, and et cetera, et cetera, as we know what to do. Um, but at the time, I was just now nah, cigar. You cut, cut it, the end, and you, you smoke it. That's it. Um, and then a guy moved next door, moved in next door to me, several years ago, and 
uh, I was smoking a cigar outside, and he brought his pipe over, and he's like, hey, you mind if I sit with you and smoke? I'm like, oh, no, have, have a seat. So, he lit up his bowl, and it just, uh, just being around the tobacco and everything, just, and the, the smell coming off his pipe, and it just, and just him having it just looked really cool, uh, smelled great, so, that kind of convinced me to get a little bit more serious about investigating pipes, and I told my wife about this, and she was trying to encourage me, yeah, go ahead and do it, but I still dragged my feet, so she finally just said, look, I'm buying you a pipe for Christmas, and, uh, and that was it, that was this past Christmas, and the rest is, is pretty much history. As soon as she mentioned that she was going to get me a pipe, I jumped right onto YouTube and started watching you guys' videos who are out there now. And, uh, and I decided not only is pipe smoking a great hobby, uh, it, it, it seems to uh, bring together such a neat, diverse group of people, um, especially here on YouTube. And uh, I think that was really what kind of drove it home for me, is the YouTube community. And I'm like, yeah, I'm definitely going to get the pipe, and I'm definitely going to start making videos on YouTube. <clears throat> and uh, that's where that's what leads me up to right now. So, favorite tobacco right now is our early morning pipe. Uh, that's my go-to. And uh, for cigars, I'm going to say it's probably the Olivas. The O's and G's and D's of the world. Again. Of course you can, buddy. It's my youngest. <laughs> and, uh, well, I hope I have satisfied your requirements. Um, I want to thank you again for the contest and congratulations once more. And, uh, as always, YouTube, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Take care.